Good morning, guys. I'm Good drinking morning, some guys. coffee. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. We all look crazy. We just like touching the camera around. <laughs> We're eating some eggs, some talkies, some coffee. The girls are having the same thing. You can tell they have a Hispanic tongue. We love their talkies. Um, I still haven't taken my makeup off. <laughs> I still haven't taken my makeup off. But um, today we have to drop off Natalie to school. Or to her bus stop, actually. We have to all get ready and look cute for the day. Um, and then I'll probably just run some errands for a little bit. I don't know. It's my day off. So we'll see what we do. It's a beautiful day outside. The sun is shining. I fell asleep for like three hours after I dropped off Anthony to school. Because I'm like, I'm so tired. I just need to like sleep. So that's what I did. And that's what we're doing right now. Right? Okay, let's eat. Let's eat, guys, so we can drop off Natalie. Doesn't it suck when our little kids do this? This is Anthony's baby picture. And Leah drew all over it. Why would you do that, Mama? Mm -hmm. She drew all over his picture, but it's okay. We're gonna keep it. Memories, memories. <laughs> Hurry up, Mama. It's so pretty outside, you guys. Ellie, are you ready to go to school? Are you excited to go? Oh, it's okay. You guys always rub everything. Who wants to see? <laughs> you guys, my skin has not been good to me lately. Or probably I haven't been good to my skin, but I just needed to do a mask. And I've had this mask ever since, what's it called? Since Christmas. I just had it there, and I guess today was the day to use it, and it feels so good. But I hope it does something to this face, because it really needs my face. I've just been so, like, I've been neglecting my face lately and I sleep with makeup and I just I you know I just haven't been taking as much care of it as I usually do and I just it's gotten to a point where I can like see it like in my pores I can see it like in my acne so I'm just trying to like rub it all into my skin so that it gets nice and soaked up so I have CR tonight. I'm still going, which is crazy. I got my, I think it was my six month trip last week, which is crazy. I've been going for six months. And if you're religious anyway, or maybe if you're not, but you're struggling with something, I think CR has definitely helped me. Um, I'm not addicted to anything. Like I wasn't an alcoholic or a drug addict. You know, I wasn't addicted to like porn or anything like that. But I went, I've, I've been going because of my past, kind of, and also because I was, I felt like I needed somebody there with me, like, all the time. Like, I was that person, that I needed my ex there. Um, and honestly, that's why I started go going, because I ended my six-year-long relationship. I ended it, it, and I felt like I just needed to move on I felt like I didn't know who I was I was always stressed I was always like I needed to be in control of everything but yet I wasn't in control sorry that I keep touching my like face but yeah I wasn't like in control of everything because I can't be like I just felt the need to but it was just stressing me out I felt like my life was just out of control because even though like it seemed put together if you guys see like my videos and stuff like that it was like all mentally, like everything was going good, but mentally I wasn't okay. And CR has helped me kind of just, just cope with it. You don't, honestly, you don't let it go. You just cope with things. And um, God has played a big factor in that. So I'm going to go to CR tonight. We're going to try a bath bomb for the first time ever. Are you ready? Wow. Wow. Wow, it's wow. Leave it, please. Wow. I love it, mommy. Put it down. I love it. You love it? I love it. Lift it up. Now look, look at me and smile really big. Will you look? Okay, I'll put it down. Okay, 
And then we also have so we're also gonna try these. We have tried these before. They're so cool yeah, yeah, and we love them. So they just pop and they make really cool sounds in the back. So I just put them in his hand. Aaliyah hates these because they pop. You want some? She usually doesn't like them. Okay, now put them under the water. Wow. You guys hear that? Ooh. Okay. Crazy hair day, guys. Ah, la, la, la. I didn't have a coffee cup, so I'm using this cup. <laughs> but it's crazy hair. Look at my toe. What? Uh-oh. The flower fell down. The flower, the tree fell down. Right the, I can't zoom in for you guys. Right there. Okay, let's go, let's get in the car. Let's go, let's go. You guys, it is so beautiful outside. We stopped with cleaning for a little bit. It's 60 degrees, it's so pretty. Um, and yeah, I love the way my hair looks whenever it's straight. I just feel like whenever my hair is straight, it kind of looks like I have my life put together because it's straight. And instead of like all over the place, usually it's like super frizzy. And every time I straighten my hair, somebody either says, I like your haircut, or what did you do different? Because my hair, like being straight, not everyone sees it like straight because I like I barely straighten my hair. Whenever I do, um, it's like I have time to straighten it or I just, I'm like really wanting to straighten it so I straighten it. So I don't straighten it very often. Whenever I do straighten it, I try not to wash it because it takes me a long time to straighten my hair. <laughs> so I try not to wash it for, I like I can go up to like four days without washing my hair. Um, but then I do have like a dry, um, I have dandruff and stuff. So it itches my hair everywhere. Um, yeah, I'm so talkative today. Like I was vlogging today too. And um, what's it called? I was just talking forever. And I don't know why I'm so talkative. Hi guys. So I came to urgent care because like I'm in so much pain today. So much pain. It's insane. I feel like breathe through the pain. It kind of feels like childbirth, like contractions. But right here, like this is where the pain is. Like I have to breathe whenever like I get like a little it gets worse so yeah it got really bad today so I'm just I got off of work and I came here because I am hurting so bad so I'll probably film at the back what the doctor says but I'm not sure so I'm not sure what they're gonna do okay guys so I just realized I didn't really explain to you guys what I was talking about whenever I was um like, I didn't never really told you guys what was going on um, with me, and that's why I'm in urgent care, so I'm going to explain to you right now. So, um, backtrack to, like, about two weeks ago, I was kind of sick, and I had this really bad cough, like, a really bad cough, um, for a while, and, um, after I was kind of getting over the cough, my, like, down here, it started to hurt really bad, and I thought... Well, maybe it's just a cough. Maybe I'm just sore from coughing so much. Um, so I was like, it's probably nothing. I'm just going to wait that out like a week or so and hope that, you know, it gets better and that it's not sore from me coughing all the time. So then um, it was a week, like a week went by and I was actually getting worse. And I, I noticed that it would go away, come back. And then all of a sudden, like it never went away. Like it was always there. And it always just kind of like hurt, but it would hurt more like if I would eat and if I would eat too much or if I would drink soda. Like it would just hurt more. <clears throat> and then there was days where like I couldn't sleep right because I couldn't breathe. It just wasn't like I've started to realize it wasn't normal and it wasn't, it wasn't okay. So then I waited it out like one more week and, um, yeah, then after that, I'm just like, I need answers because it just kept getting worse and worse and worse. And that day that I went, that day that I went to urgent care, I was like really, really like, I was in a lot of pain and I couldn't breathe. And then like people at my job started to notice and they're like, you need to go to hospital or you need to go to the doctor or something. Actually, first it was all right here. And then after like a week or so, it started to just be like right here. Like this is where my pain is right here. And it, then it goes, like, to the back of my, like, to the back over here. 
and it's so weird and so they took some x-rays whenever I was at the hospital um, and then I explained the rest in the next clip so I just want to clear that up okay guys so I just got out of the out of the urgent care thingy I kind of felt discouraged because I really thought it was a lot more than what they told me which is fine like I like I don't want it like I'm not hoping to like have such bad things but I really don't like going to a doctor or to anything unless I have to and I felt like I was in enough pain to go and I've been dealing with it for like two weeks now so I think I like <laughs> I could go but they didn't think it was anything like bad and he said that if it does get worse if this doesn't help me then um then it'll show your um it just right now is nothing showing up so I totally understand and well it's not that nothing's showing up it's just that they don't understand why my pain is getting like worse and worse um so yeah let me explain to you guys what I have so they said I have pleurisy pleurisy I think that's how you pronounce it and um sorry if I'm like jerking it's because it's hurting right now so it is um the pleura are two air thin layers of tissue that surround your lungs and that line the inside of your chest cavity there's a small amount of fluid between the pleura 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 that helps the layers move easily when you breathe when pleura is irritated or swollen the layer rubs together as you breathe i don't know i feel like that doesn't explain my pain because i like he was explaining it to me and he was like just take these and if you do have any like inflammation there it'll take it down but if it is like stomach problems or something like that then it'll probably irritate them but if they do irritate you like you know go to your primary physician whatever so but like everything that he's saying i'm like but it's not in my chest like this is my chest area i'm hurting down here so i don't understand why so i don't know i'll just take it and see how if it does help me at all because i'm in so much pain you guys like i know i look fine but like inside i'm like like it hurts really bad so i'm just trying to figure out what the hell's wrong with me because it really hurts i can't a subway to get something because i'm starving I'm starving I haven't ate since this morning so i'm gonna eat something real quick and hope i feel better uh but you're not getting that Aaliyah. yes what are you wearing some sandals and socks <laughs> we ran out of the house and she got some like sandals it's bacon. oh okay and eat bacon too. okay but we can't have put the toothpaste away i'll get my own toothpaste okay We'll get these. Ella, tell them what they what we found. We found equate brushes. <laughs> Let me help you. Uh huh. For three ninety eight. Yep, three dollars so and ninety cents each. I got my own batch, and she got her own patch as well. And then um, Maybelline has a sale. Well, here at my Walmart, they have a sale on their brow gel for three dollars. Mm -hmm. And then my translucent powder. And that's yeah. about it. And I'm getting in this these brushes right here actually they're four brushes so hopefully they're all 3.98 but if they are that's so good because this is a foundation brush highlighting brush um i would use this one for like my blush and i would use this for my powder not that i need any more brushes but we'll see how they go my sister's only getting the kabuki brush and the multi-purpose brush that i'm getting this dry shampoo that i'm gonna try out and i'm getting a spray bottle and I have my medicine there, so that's it. Miss Leah, what you doing, girl? What you doing? I want these, but they're like $14 for this. That's a little too, too much. Ooh, look, at, is this new? Yeah, they came out with a new foundation. We should try that too. Guys, let us know if you want us to try anything. Look at these beautiful lashes. Like, do you see this, Kayla? You see this thickness? I know. I love it. I That's want crazy. it. That's crazy. I want it. Should I get it? It is so Seven dollars? No, you don't want these. They're so dramatic. Oh, exactly. Lashes look regular on me. That's the problem. Look at these. I, Leslie, I oh want these Oh my so gosh. Bad. Those are so thick. Crazy. I want them so bad. Let's see, I think these are pretty. If you were to get some, get these. This is too hard. Oh, no, there's seven dollars. Yeah. We are the drugstore queens. What are you doing with that thumb? What are you doing with that thumb? What are you doing with that thumb? This is what happens when we come to Walmart. We're so bad at this. Ugh. Yeah. 
that's it for this little vlog that I had today I hope you guys enjoyed it if you did give it a thumbs up this is my background that I, I put a new background in and it's like a quilt it's literally a blanket it's like a blanket but I put it up there I pinned it if you guys are wondering how I do it I pin my backgrounds with just pins and then I just record in front of them and that's about it that reminds me I have to edit a video for y'all it's a makeup tutorial that I uploaded or that I did I mean that I recorded but I haven't edited I recorded it last week for you guys I have to edit that probably will be tomorrow and I have to edit this vlog I hope you guys enjoyed it so don't forget to like this video if you guys liked it and don't forget to comment if you guys feel like it and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet um don't forget to click the notification as well if you do subscribe um it just notice sends you notifications when we upload new videos so that's it guys we love you we'll see you guys next time look at her what is you doing girl what is you doing it's ladder no i'm trying to see Tonight I'm going to see. Can you say bye to our friends? Bye, my friends. <laughs> Peace out, guys. Love y'all. Love you. <laughs>